up, Woody Nerdigans. This is the one and only Packer Girl 89 of Nerdigans Inc. Today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Akane Fanashi chapters 91 through 95. But before I get into this recap and live reaction, well, we are at war with uh, um, YouTube's algorithm and it is slowly but surely killing my channel. And in order to defeat this algorithmic beast, please hit that like, share, and subscribe buttons. And because, of course, this channel, let alone this video, are not sponsored and not. We ain't sponsored by Shueisha, and nah, we ain't sponsored by Manga Plus, and nah, we ain't sponsored by Visa, considering how much we promote Manga Plus on this channel. It's kind of surprising, right? <laughs> but if you love what we're doing and want to help keep me, my adorable little kitty, who's somewhere around here, and this operation alive and kicking, so we can keep bringing you more anime and manga content, whether it be news, analysis, or live reactions like this one, feel free to hit up our Cash App and PayPal. Links are in the description box below. So... Well, last time I covered this manga, we, we found out that a a Connie's papa is coming back, which is going to be very, very interesting. And she's also going to be um, uh, part of, um, we also know what show she's going to be doing next, and it's going to be a big one. So let's get to chapter 91 first, see what's in store for us today. Oh, before I forget, because obviously we've got the Spanish version of Akane Banashi up. What I'm going to do is in regards to the opening and closing text, um, starting with chapter 96 is when I'm going to start doing it um, for Akane Banashi. But anyways, so chapter 91 is titled Errands to Run. Um, <clears throat> that's right, there were only four people at the first show. And look at us now. What do you think, Jumbo? Isn't that wild? So that's what it was for. I just thought it was a Halloween costume or something. No way, I don't have time for that, that stuff like that. Sorry, sorry, but it worked out, huh? It looks like smooth sailing for you, I suppose. Including the stories um, I'm learning, now I'm up to 39. I found a, co a connection to learn code on from, too. By the end of the year, I think I'll meet all the requirements except for the recommendation by one of the ARC 4. So for the Fudetsume promotion list, you have to uh, you have to use, learn 50 Rakugo stories, um, code on historical stories, music and dance, and taiko drums. Really? Wow, and to think that you were panicking not long ago because your story wasn't getting a passing grade or whatever. <laughs> Well, that was well, um, every master has their own standards for pass. Oh, sorry, I fucked this up. That was, well, every master has their own standards for passing. Oh, yeah? Huh? Is this, uh, the guy who, oh, Karashi? Yeah, he was in that big Rakugo competition with me last year. He joined a Rakugo school this spring, so we're in the same class, uh, uh, so to speak. Huh? What does that look mean? Nothing. He just seems kind of mean, you know? Really? Well, he can be harsh at times, but he's a nice guy. Karashi's cool. <laughs> I felt a horrifying chill. Being in the same school basically means you're friends. I'd I'd rather be your op wait. Being in the school the same school basically means you're friends. I'd rather be your opponent. Said the guy in the costume right here. You seem pretty friendly to me. What's with the change of heart? I even gave a Connie my photo album. I ain't like that. I have my reasons. Okay, I'll teach you. But focus on Asa's study event for now. Got it. Connie could have invited me to join this fun event, too. I feel left out. She's not even listening. Complain to her, then. You came to watch her a while back, didn't you? I went to meet her. I wanted to meet Connie um, again, but only in competition. That's why I went to you um, instead, Junior. Huh? Wow, I'm so flattered. I'm surprised you seem so unfazed right now. I saw the Arakawa new breeze. When all um, was said and done, it was the uh, Kaisei Anisan Ani show. The only other person who maybe benefited from it was uh, Koguma Anisan. Beyond that, um, I know you don't have to spell it out. I know I'm inexperienced, and that I'm going nowhere fast. I need a weapon even greater than the eight blind men technique. What are you laughing about? Nothing. I'm just thinking it's funny that uh, you get so worked up about stuff. You were the one who brought it up. Also, a little respect, please. Yeah, yeah, apologies, your highness. Anyway, if you ever uh, want to hold a study event, too, feel free to hit me up. Maybe I'm available. You're leaving? Yeah, I got errands to run. Errands? You have a meeting about the big debut event in a bit. Plus, I have some Rakuga practice with Master. Sounds like a lot of work. Eh, it's not bad, really. Risa went to technical school, so she's already looking for jobs. Yuka's doing illustrations on the side while she goes to college. And you've got your judo, right? Everyone's doing their best at something. I can't be the only one not keeping up. God damn, you monk gods, why you mock at me still? Oh, you showed up together. Uh, by coincidence, uh, we ran into, um, into each other outside. That's fine, I don't care. Come on up. 
The masters are already here. Ooh, there's so much pressure. Um, this must be Ta Master Taizen Arakawa. Ooh, perfect timing. Let me introduce them to you, Tainoji. Uh, this will, who will uh, be the opener for Asa's debut, Akane Arakawa. Come on, don't just stare, she'll get shy. And just so you know, it was my apprentice here who picked her. Who, uh, picked her. He said that she's done a lot for him and he insisted. Therefore, I have a proposal. Would you be willing to give her a Fuditsume recommendation? Huh? You're in the art four, so you can do that, depending on her performance opening the show, of course. Hmm? What's wrong? That, give you, that gives you more motivation, right? Yes, it does, but it's almost too much of a good thing. Why? Uh, you need a reason? When you feel good about someone, you uh, bet big on them. It's the gambler's nature. Being an Arakawa Fuditsume means coming under the critical eye of Master Isho. Do you know what that means? It must not be a disgrace. I think I know what that means better than anyone. I'll undertake the first step to, um, to Fuditsume with every single ounce of strength I have. Ooh, let's see. In chapter 92 is titled Specialty. Yo, it's me, the only person at the selection round to receive a recommendation for Fuditsume. Zemai Arakawa. Oh, what kind of greeting is... Uh, let me read this. Yo, it's only, um, it's me, the only person at the selection round to receive a recommendation for Fuditsume, uh, Semi Arakawa. Oh, what kind of greeting is that? Oh, I just, um, I just forgot, I uh, thought you might have forgotten. Anyway, I think I'll be tough to get the nod from Master Tyson. He's an apprentice of our master who's known for hating Master Shiguma. Um, the other thing about Master Tyson is, uh, since he became one of the Arc Four, he hasn't given us a single Fuditsume recommendation. Was that all? He's le already left. Yeah, today was more of a meet and greet. So what do you think of uh, Tainoji? Mm, he was super freaky. Uh, so much pressure. You know, right? But his eyes. He had the same vibe as uh, my master and Anisans. If I want to keep advancing, there's only one person I need right now. I want a recommendation for Master Tyson. Yeah! All of that to say the most obvious thing. I'm the main event. This is my day. I... <laughs> I know that, and shut up, Karashi. <laughs> um, uh, all right, enough figuring of, uh, get yourselves ready. We're gonna practice your stories now. You got the go-ahead from old man Enzo, right? Yes, it was a special exception. Perfect, all right, Kara boy, you'll be learning one for show. And for the little lady, I'll teach you Tanuki Dice. Ooh, okay, so Tanuki Dice is about a man saves a Tanuki, which repays its debt by transforming into dice to, uh, into die to help him uh, win big at gambling. It's an animal type, zen, uh, Zenzabanashi. Tanuki Dice, I haven't heard this one yet, but if I was going to learn one from him, um, what, you wanted to learn one for show instead? Sorry. <laughs> Listen, you know what a specialty is? It's like when Saika Anigo and her um, uh, Kuro, uh, Kurobanashi, a story that becomes synonymous with that Rakugoka. To put it in more modern terms, it's kind of like your ultimate attack. From what I hear, you're good at animal stories. Plus, given the spirit you showed um, while playing Chohan, I think you've got a lot in common with me. If you perform this story my way, I know it'll be a hit. The type of story I'm good at in the art of sunshine. So you think Tanuki Dice could be my specialty? Oh, that all depends on you. What do you say? Feel up like to trying it out? Ooh, this is gonna be good. Yes, sir. From there, um, Tanuki mindset. <laughs> Tanuki mindset. Tanuki mindset. I thought things over. Um, I thought things over on my own. Memorize the the weight, size, and feel of the die so I can visualize it even with my eyes closed. That's actually pretty smart. Um, to heighten my art. Ow. Unlike when I was learning fetching tea, I'm comfortable with this type of story. I can feel it really sinking in. So. Have you mastered it since the last practice session? Let's see you perform now. At this rate, what do you think? Um, actually, I'm kind of amazed. Actually, maybe you're not like me at all. Huh? But you said I was earlier. I mean, you are in a way. But how should I say this? You might be kind of crazy off, um, off of the stage, but when it comes to Rakugo, you're dead serious, huh? Is that a bad thing? It ain't bad at all, but it's not enough. You could do better. You're not, you're not even using half of your ability yet. Yeah, I know what he's saying. He's saying that, Akane, you need to have more fun with it. Tizen, yo, um, nothing to say to your master, huh? Not that I mind, I'm used to your silence, and I know uh, that without discussing it with me, you would agree to appear in an event with um, an Okaban from the Rakuka Federation. 
that's all perfectly fine and good. You are with the Arakawa Art 4 now, even if you've, uh, if, even if you're below me in rank. As your master, I'm proud of you. What I'm not so proud of are my current apprentices. Between the selection event and the new breeze, both of my rising apprentices have put up poor showings. Um, coming in behind Shiguma students. I can't have that. Now, now it looks like my teaching ability, my very dignity as a Rakugo master, is inferior to the man who cannot even produce a single Shinoichi. I happen to hear that Chiguma's new girl will be in this debut event, and she probably wants a recommendation from you. Oh no, whatever happens, don't um, ever give a recommendation to one of Shiguma's pupils. He needs to be properly punished. Oh, and this is a master's order. You must obey. Oh, that is fucked up. All right, let's see. So chapter 93 is titled My Words. So I'm still not producing half of my ability? Nope. Are you saying I can be uh, twice as good as I am now? I've got so much, uh, I've got so much potential to fulfill. Uh, you bet, if you play your cards right, you could uh, be twice the Rakugoku you are now. In fact, even better, more than twice as good. I love how she's picturing it. <laughs> um, like Akane, Tyrannosaurus, and Triceratops. Jesus Christ, woman. How do I say that? Um, wait, how do I do that? What am I missing right now? It's the reverse. You've got too much. You have deep roots. Ordinarily, you need to take um, your time to figure this out. But since there's no time until the debut event, that leaves only one option. You leave it up to chance. If you manage to capture the knack of it, you'll make stratospheric gains. But if you fail, you might lose your touch for all the art you've built up. High risk, high return. A major gamble on low odds. If you'd rather go slow and steady, there are, um, there are other routes. I understand. So what should I do? I guess I needn't have asked. <laughs> I'm going to place one restriction on you. For the two months until the debut, you are, you're not allowed to use Edo dialect. Edo dialect? You mean like all the rough and tough tumble uh, common phrases in Rakugo? So I says to him, that's right, none of those. If I can't use them, then I basically can't perform Rakugo. What about Tanuki Dice? How will I practice it? What kind of question is that? You just do it, obviously. Perform Tanuki Dice without Edo dialogue. What? <laughs> Relearn Tanuki Dice using the vocabulary that you normally use. That's simple, huh? If I change the words, then I'm not performing the master's art anymore. Plus, what are my words? Let's take this scene, for example. If I go back without repaying you, I'll never hear uh, the end of it from the other Tanuki. Would it be more like this? Oh, gee, if I leave now, I'm, like, so screwed. <laughs> <laughs> or should um, I take it further? Uh, bruh, LMAO, I'm so getting... No, no, no! Okay, this is gonna get checked. No, 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 no. No, this cannot, no. I refuse to believe that this is the translation for this. But hang on, what about um the scene where he says, uh, Nininka Poot, just you watch. Would this be more my style? Wait, what are my words anyway? Oh my god, I have to check this. Okay, the Spanish version here. This is what I'm getting from Deep L. Is stop the car. If you come back, you'll get it. Where is the canceled shit from? The fuck is this? Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, we are going to be putting this up. On Twitter. What are my words anyway? I don't get it. Why does it feel like this question keeps coming up? Um, I don't look. Um. Uh, Mom, don't look! At this point, former class three, uh, two of Ryo, uh, Ryo Gyoku high, uh, high members, let me hear you make some noise. Are you having a good time? Yeah! Wait, this isn't what I wanted. I know, I know. You want us to listen and tell you um, if you fixed up Rakugo sounds like you, right? Uh, so shall we sing now? Were you, li were you listening? Look, who cares? We're doing your... Uh, um, we're doing your thing, so you have to do our thing, too. Is she kind of on, uh, kind of on edge? Risa's stressed, uh, looking for a job. All right, all right, I'll sing one, so one song. She's, she was always practicing Rakugo in high school. This might be the first time I've heard Akane sing. What's her song? Oh, she's singing an Aldi! <laughs> you whisper that love to me, uh, love, you, <laughs> love me, but I know you're just a Tanuki! Um, you won't let your tail show, but... You are where my thoughts go, uh, the serenity of Tanuki love. She's singing oldies. What? It's a 40-year-old song. You're so old-fashioned, but really good at singing. Um, what a bizarre choice. 
When I have a rakugo practice at a karaoke place, sometimes Master teaches me old songs. Oh, I see. Well, that's all fine and good. But I think we need I need to teach you some newer songs. We're staying here all night. Uh, we're staying here all night. No, nah, I'm out. Oh, let's sing all night. I want to hang out. I'm tired of applying for jobs. Woman, I feel your pain. Look, I need to be, um, I, look, I need to uh, be searching for my own art. You might be overthinking it. When you question your own style, you start to lose sight of what it is. Happens in illustrations, too. Yuka, she's right. Um, you gotta lighten up a little. Oh, I know. You remember how you used to imitate the teachers in middle school? Just have fun with it like that. Um, but those were just impressions. Um, what about the uh, that other time when your dad showed up in fifth grade? Oh, the fake, the fake crying incident. Oh, don't give it a name. It's my embarrassing past. Uh, you did it back then. You were using normal words but performing them like Rakugo. Isn't that what he means? You got too much. Um, sorry to drop in on you out of the blue, and you even uh, served me a drink. I don't mind. I hear you've been a great help to my pupil. Okay, so now we're back with the gambler here. It ain't a problem at all. I took a personal interest in her. I see. I've heard about the big debut event. I'm surprised you managed to talk Tyson into it. Let me tell you, it wasn't easy, but I thought the timing was right. We left things hanging ever since that day. I wanted to get some closure on that, whether we repair the loose ends or let it be a clean break. I see that whole mass expulsion. Some say it was lack of skill, and others blame themselves for it. I've heard plenty of rumors. But the real reason was something else, wasn't it? Like, for example, um, the thing that uh, Shinoji was always after, the old um, master that you and Master Ishio both uh, learned under. Wasn't that known as Shiguma, or sorry, the previous Shiguma left behind an unfinished story, and wasn't that known as Shiguma's art? Ooh! Okay, now we're getting to chapter 94. So chapter 94 is titled, This is a Major Event. That beautiful color page, too. Shiguma's art? Shiguma's art? What will you do with that knowledge? Eh, nothing really. Honestly, I'm not the kind of guy who gets curious about other people's past. But, um, Tainoji's still dragging the memory of the expulsion with him. He blamed himself for what happened and bottled up that anger until it earned him the epithet of, um, epithet the furious. Now he's, uh, as harsh as, um, as a demon towards himself and others. It's hard to, uh, watch him if I'm being honest, but only, um... But only he can decide uh, how to process what happened. If you want a recommendation, if you want a recommendation, you need to convince him in his own style. That's how it works. That's the gamble. However, I don't like the idea of that roll of the dice being tainted by nonsense from up above. Um, I'm aware that Ma uh, Master Zensho has a significant grudge against you, Master Shiguma, even if it's a one-sided thing. Knowing his personality, there's no question he'll throw a wrench in the works. Um, when that happens, she's going to need someone to be in her corner. Whatever your reason was at the time, reasoning was at the time, you weren't able to protect uh, uh, Shinoji back then. But things have changed. I have power now, Raku Rakugo Federation. Yeah. And if even my friend's kid is, and if even my friend's kid is gonna suffer on account of this nonsense, I ain't gonna take it lying down. You tell him. Well, you certainly talk the talk, but I don't need you to tell me the score. If it comes to it, I intend to take matters into my own hands. Glad to hear it. Forgive me for running my mouth at you there. Ah, don't you dare apologize. Look, it's going to ruin the taste of this fine sake, isn't it? <laughs> sake, you say? What kind? Sake for three. Uh, sake for free? <laughs> no, shut up. So, how, uh, how does she seem to you? Is Akane uh, Fudetsume material? I don't know. That's for uh, Tainoji to decide. All I can do is set the scene for her and trust her to do her best. Well, hopefully she does. So you want to, you want me to tell you if uh, your version of Tanuki Dice makes for a proper Rakugo? Uh, bingo! After all, if putting it in my words doesn't make it seem like Rakugo anymore, what's the point? Well, sure, but dress like that? Yes, well, if you say so, but it's not going to feel like Rako Rakugo if you're not in a kimono. Yes, exactly. Anyway, here goes. Here we go. The end. That was Tanuki Dice, and that's how it sounds. Be honest, was it terrible? Uh, sorry. Um, seems okay, right? How strange. The words she used were completely different, but sounded just as natural as any other Rakugo. Um, you're being honest, right? Why would I lie about this, idiot? I guess it I, I went over pretty well. Oh, by the way, he's coming to the event debut, right? <gasps> your dad! He's coming! Your dad, I mean. Um, you knew, huh? I heard about it from Master. Um, um... Sorry, I, I, I know I didn't need to tell you, uh, tell you I knew, but it seemed weird to keep it a secret. Nah, that's fine. This is the first time my dad is coming to see a performance of mine. It is? Then you gotta be ready for it. Exactly. 
So I'm coming to steal the show from you, Annie san Squish me? Squish me? Bring it, I'll cut you to ribbons. So they, so they even have debut events for new Fudetsume, huh? Well, it wasn't until recently that um, they started happening. He looks like a, he looks wild. Check out that hair. Tickets were instantly sold out and the media um, uh, requests are overwhelming, I hear. You really don't know anything, huh? What's that supposed to mean? Don't bully me. Um, once Raku uh, Rakugoka and Tokyo are qualified to take disciples, they always join the Rakuga Federation. But the one group that is affiliated with the Federation and yet charts its own unique courses as outsiders is the Arakawa School. Huh? Are they allowed to do that? Oh, it's a source of friction, all right. There was always debate about the proper direction of the Federation, as I understand it. But the cause of the biggest rift was the mass expulsion uh, perpetrated by Isho Arakawa. It was a it was bi um, a big enough scandal that the mainstream wall or mainstream media took note. Um, that had a huge impact on their uh, public image. Master Shiguma is just um, barely keeping uh, both sides together for now. But ever since that incident, there's been a rift at the top between both camps. They're in a cold war at the moment. And now some major members of these opposing factions are performing together. This is a major event. It's going to shake the world of Edo Rakugo to its core. I'll understand. Uh, I'll undertake the first step to Fudetsume with every ounce of strength I have. Don't give a recommendation to Akane Arakawa. Oh god, here we go. And so with each person brings in their own feelings and intentions. The time has come for the debut event. As Asagao um, Kanjakude uh, Fudetsume debut performance. Let's go. Let's get into this. And chapter 95 is titled It's Been a While. Daddy's here too, remember. Um, it seems really tense back here. I thought it'd be a, more of a party atmosphere. Ordinarily it would, but there's a lot of attention on this debut. Who guessed that the chairman of the uh, Rakugo Federation himself, the national treasure, would show up in person? The flat crested kimono looks good on you. Thank you, sir. Master um, Moroku, I'm grateful that you decide to attend. Hey, Chocho. Um, um, hey, Chocho. Shumi was whining about, uh, about it. You didn't explain anything. Ha, it's called a surprise, man. <laughs> I was thinking of sticking around to the end today. Sure, be our guest. Uh, is that all right? Well, of course. I'll show you to the waiting room. It's been several years since I heard an Arakawa performance. I think I'll enjoy this one. Right this way. Is that honesty? It, um, it was always hard to tell with the, uh, his true intentions. Asagiwani-san, uh, Asagiwani-san, I brought the extra box of hand towels. Oh, thanks a bunch. Busy day for you, huh? Running errands before your big performance? Well, these errands are the majority of Azenza's duties. Plus, I'm all ready to go and prepared and I'm primed. My mood right now is bring it on. Uh, that's what I like to hear. <laughs> so where's Tenoji then? Um, Master Chocho, I just received a, ma a ma uh, message from Master Tizen. Tenoji's going to be late? Why? What's his excuse? I'm sorry I didn't ask. But he said he'll make sure that he arrives on time even if it's uh, right down to the wire. So he wants you to leave the order as, um, as it is. He doesn't want to cause any delays. I'm sorry about this. Um, even an important debut, he often reaches the venue after the show has already begun. Damn it, the point being, he'll do the job he was asked to do, but he doesn't want to engage with her gamble. Uh, I have I have a hard time imagining that stubborn hard ass doing it, something so pathetic after this, that speech he gave, which means it was that damn afro. Yep. Uh, got it. I'll call uh, Tenoji myself. Master, um, is there anything I could do? I appreciate the thought, but you don't know the situation or where you stand, so there's nothing you could do here. Just be patient and have faith. Got that? Damn it, come on! Where is he? Oh, he's the... Don't ever give a recommendation to one of Shiguma's pupils. It is the pinnacle of unfairness, and yet he is my master. I cannot defy him. On the other hand, to treat art with anything less than total honesty would violate my artistic principles. But I'll undertake the first step to Fudetsume with every ounce of strength I have. Mm. You seem to be struggling uh, mightily with something. Oh, is that dad? Whenever there was a problem weighing on your mind, you always went to a place with a lot of green. I see that habit hasn't let you. It hasn't left you. He's here! Oh my god! It's been a while, Tizen. He's here! Shinta! Shinta Arakawa! It's been a while since anyone's called me by that name. But Shinta Arakawa is dead. I'm Toru Osaki, just a regular old concrete salesman. He's here! I can't believe it! He's here! Oh 
my god. Anyways, this is gonna be interesting. So we got the stage is set now. There's a huge there's um inner turmoil going on, but well, there's gonna be a lot of turmoil on social media today because I'm gonna expose that fucking cancel culture translation. Oh my god, I can't believe this shit is happening again. But anyways, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. What you guys hear, um, uh, what you guys think of uh these chapters. Are you excited to see what's gonna go down? Um uh next chapter let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and remember to like comment share and subscribe to nerdigans inc love what we're doing and want to help keep this operation alive and kicking so we can keep bringing you more connie banashi content few ways you can do that donate to our cash app paypal patreon purchase something off our amazon wish list all that's in the description box below also make sure you follow us on twitter twitch discord find us on playstation network that's in the description box below as well till next time nerdigans i will be seeing you later bye